Hi guys, this is Divyansh, and today in this video, uh, we are going to talk about the apps that were uh, recently uninstalled by the government of India. Uh, guys, these are basically the Chinese apps, and uh, finally, Indian government took a very good step. Uh, and I appreciate the Indian government for doing such uh, good work. Uh, but guys, I feel that they should have did this uh, a lot earlier. But uh, there is like a metaphor in uh, Hindi, guys. There's a proverb that they are either who's there. So uh, that's the situation that uh, the Indian government has we are in right now. And I'm very happy that these apps are now finally gone. Uh, but guys, every story has two sides. Uh, but we are just seeing the one side. The uh, these apps were banned. It will harm China in some way because uh, considering the Indian population and the ban of those apps uh, while considering the Indian population, the China is going to take a major hit, guys. And uh, I'm very happy with that because they have done such shitty things to our uh, Indian soldiers. They deserve that. They and uh, and guys, it's very good to see that the whole world is with us right now. Every if you ask any country. They will say the name of India first, uh, the most helping country and all. India has done very good in this time. Also, we are all together, and uh, that's the reason China is hating us Indians. And uh, this is a very good move by the government of India, and I totally support it. Guys. I feel, guys, uh, it's a good move, but uh, we have to think about the other side also, guys. And let me speak about the other side, guys. uh and before uh, uh speaking uh, before telling you that just let me make me uh, let it make me clear guys that uh, i am a pure indian i love my country i love india jai hind mahab jai hind jai bharat and uh, <coughs> guys i will be speaking some facts that you might like or not uh, like it so guys based upon you you can go from this video and uh, if you want to hear just stay with me guys uh tiktok let's let me first talk about tiktok uh tiktok is a very uh popular platform guys it is uh, one of the most popular social media platforms as of now uh and the reason why people were more inclined towards tiktok was its easeability to use it's a very entertaining app guys uh i personally don't use tiktok or i don't i never had a tiktok app in my uh phone uh whatever it be uh i used to see tiktok in instagram uh tiktok videos in instagram and i feel it has a lot of positivity in it guys but the reality is that it is the reality that is shown in uh tiktok is very hypothetical uh nowadays people are, uh, none of the people you can see like that uh what is shown in tiktok so that's a other thing guys but i want to just uh, point out to the reason why people were opting uh, for uh, tiktok is that it is very easy to use guys the algorithms that are used in the tiktok can spread your contact very uh, uh, in a very fast way when compared to youtube you can get more if your content is if you are really talented and uh, your content is really good it is a very it it is there is a more chance you get popular very easily when compared to youtube so that was the reason guys and uh, uh, tiktok was very popular and you don't have to work that hard uh, for tiktok if uh, uh, when compared to you're working for youtube for youtube you have to work really very hard guys so that's a reason guys i uh, feel and guys uh, tiktok was a chinese app but was a positive app i feel i don't know about data breaching from uh, tiktok but uh, it was a very positive app i feel and there were a lot of persons who were earning from tiktok also so when you look at them yeah they, there are some people who are rich uh, who will not be affected uh, uh, from going away from tiktok because they have uh, grown up so much in their life that they don't simply need tiktok platform for their work but there are some person who are, are earning from tiktok and they were highly depend and uh, they were highly dependent on tiktok for their earnings and all so for the, the, them i feel very sad in india so and guys uh, this was from the tiktok app and uh, i feel uh, it is a uh, good move by government of india but 
सम पीपल आर गोइंग टू बी एफेक्टेड सो दैट्स अ बैड थिंग ऑल्सो कमिंग टू सम एप्स लाइक शेयर इट एंड जेंडर एंड वॉल्ट गाइज वी ऑल नो वॉट वॉल्ट एप इज आई पर्सनली यूज वॉल्ट एप गाइज दे वो इट गेव्स यू द एबिलिटी टू हाइड कंटेंट एंड सब नॉट गाइज डोंट आस्क मी वॉट आई यूज टू हाइड इन माई वॉल्ट आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू कमेंट ऑन दैट प्लीज सो वॉट एप वॉज गुड गाइज यू कैन इजिली बैकअप योर डेटा यू कैन इजिली रिस्टोर योर डेटा फ्रॉम ए टू बी है ना सो इफ यू आर चेंजिंग स्मार्टफोन इट्स वेरी यूजफुल सो दैट वॉज सम देर वॉर सम वेरी यूजफुल एप्स चाइनीज एप्स दैट गॉट बैंड फ्रॉम द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ चाइना लाइक जेंडर ऑल्सो गाइज जेंडर इज द मोस्ट पॉपुलर शेयरिंग एप दैट यू सी अप ऑन राइट नाउ गाइज in nearly every indian nearly about 90% of the people use zender for sharing files so guys uh, that was a very also a very good app and the reason why these chinese apps grew uh, so much in india was the easeability to use them that is the first thing and they were very user friendly guys uh, basically uh, basically easeability and user friendly are uh, same thing but they were very easy to use guys and uh, they work so seamlessly between the devices uh, so a person who is using such kind of app will never uh, will to jump from uh, zender to any other app it's not like that uh, we don't have any other app but there are paid apps and uh, guys we as a indians uh, like to get our work done for free rather than paying for that work that is the mentality what indian ha- indians have so not indians guys everyone has that mentality so that is the reason i feel sad about zender and vault and also share it usually browser was the creepiest app and i feel it's uh, the ban of that app uh, made me the most uh, you know made me feel like uh, very much happy more than the even the tiktok guys so uh, i feel uh, some of the apps were very creepy and uh, some of the apps were not that creepy were very useful i also use zender and uh, that's the sad reality now they are gone and uh, guys i feel indian government has done a good job finally and uh, they should stick up on it they should not uh, just do it for the uh, some period of time and issue them permission to uh, run as they were running right now so if the indian government should stick on that so that's the uh, that's my feeling guys also coming to the smartphone market guys uh you guys only tell me what are the options we have uh let me first uh, make it very clear guys uh think as an average indian consumer what would be your budget if you're going out uh, to purchase a smartphone you are hardly from 10000 to 15000 uh, a uh, average indian if you're not a uh, tax savvy uh, if you're just an average indian who needs a uh, smartphone for his basic needs calling whatsapp music video playing what would be his budget he would just look at a budget of about 10 to 15000 and guys the 10 to 12000 is the sweetest spot for an average in, uh, indian consumer 15000 is also very uh, pricey smartphone i've seen people saying uh, that if uh, for example if i went to a shop and i am a average indian con- consumers i've seen people like that uh, if i told them to show me a phone of about 10000 on a budget and uh, they showed me a phone of over 12 12000 also guys i might just not consider buying at that i've seen many people like that so so you have to take into account that also guys and uh, the thing that i want to point out from this is uh, just banning this uh, apps are not an option you should provide an alternative app also if a uh, government of india is banning this apps you should provide alternative apps also that we can use uh, to uh, as seamlessly as we are using that, uh, as we were using that apps so guys that is also a point that you should note and uh, guys regarding the smartphone market we simply don't have many choices we just have samsung and i don't know where is asus right now uh we just have samsung we have nokia but the price to performance ratio what they provide at that uh, price category is just simply ridiculous our average indian per, uh, consumer will not just bother about buying the that 
स्मार्टफोन्स इवन इफ दे हैव वेरी हाई ब्रांड ब्रांड नेम द पीपल ऑफ इंडिया हैव बिकम सो कॉन्शियस दे वॉन्ट द बेस्ट वैल्यू फॉर द मनी स्मार्टफोन दे आर नॉट मोर इंक्लाइन टूवर्ड्स द ब्रांड एंड गाइज सो ब्रांड इट इज ऑल्सो अ गुड टाइम फॉर द ब्रांड्स टू कम अप विथ सम गुड प्रोडक्ट लाइक वॉट मोटोरोला डेट Yes, guys. Motorola is technically a Chinese company, but its manufacturing, its profits are mainly, and its R and D centers are mainly in uh, non-Chinese uh, countries. So, guys, uh, I feel that uh, it is a good time for uh, companies like Samsung, Nokia, and other brands, uh, ASUS, to launch good products at that uh, similar price point. It's very hard to get a smartphone, guys. with a uh, good value what chinese com- manufacturers provide us at a price point uh, when compared to the non chinese brands so this is also a thing that you need to uh, look at guys and now guys coming to my conclusion i am particularly very happy uh, with uh, in government of india banning this apps but i frankly feel that they should provide uh, uh, they should provide uh, alternative apps for for us consumers so we can continue our work as seamlessly as uh, we were continuing at that time so guys this was my video regard, uh, regarding the uh, chinese apps and my thoughts basically upon uh, banning these chinese apps i hope you like this video and guys if you feel uh, bad i'm really sorry from the depth of my heart uh, but uh, we have to look at both the sides guys it has a positive side also it has a negative side also it's going to uh, affect uh, positively to uh, uh, people like us but it's going to affect negatively to some people who are very used to that uh, chinese apps like tiktok like tiktokers uh, it will uh, leave a huge impact uh, to the life of tiktokers so guys i think uh, it's a, a fair decision by the government of india and uh, i phrase Uh, i frankly feel they should have taken this decision long ago so that's it for now guys uh, i'll see you in my next video if you have not liked my channel subscribe to my channel guys then do hit the subscribe button i'll see you in the next video take care